Okay, so this is a video of how to replace your sump pump float switch. Okay, this float switch has failed. So first thing you need to do is get your replacement. Second thing we need to do is we need to pull the power on this so you don't have power running. And then the sump pump float switch is this one and this is your pump. So put that one to the side and hold on to that one. And this is the one you're removing, okay? The next thing we'll do is untie this wire and then we'll take the top off. Okay, so the top has been removed and you'll see there's water way over where the float switch is. And so that means it needs to be replaced. And so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna turn the pump on just enough to get the water level down because there's a screw we have to take out. Okay, so the float switch has been removed. This is a new one. And I took this uh, little bracket off with this, it's a Phillips head screw, took it off. And now I will replace that back into the hole where it was. Okay, so now you can see that the float is floating. It's been reinstalled. So now what we'll do is plug this in. And you hear it came on. And it came on. So that means we're draining. So that means our float switch is working again. Here it running. to drop eventually it'll shut itself off and you may have to adjust the length the length of the pump it may need to be adjusted depending on how far how deep your pump and see it shut off see there's still water in the bottom but that's okay it'll just continue to do that so uh, that's how you replace your uh, float switch on your sump pump take it easy